Indiana weather. Unfortunately, it doesn't seem that will be the case. Let's bring in meteorologist Matthew Bullock today. Uh, Matthew, it was a great day today. What's next for us? Well, Mother Nature has spoiled us, Krista. I mean, we were in the 70s the past two days. I mean, you couldn't ask for better weather. Blue skies and sunshine, but it won't last long. We have some storms coming tonight and also cooler weather ahead. So let's just take a live look right now in downtown Fort Wayne. Plenty of blue skies and sunshine, but if you look in the distance, we do have some clouds increasing way off into the distance. As we take a look at the current temperatures right now, 72 degrees for the Summit City with mostly sunny skies. But look at the humidity, 41%. It's warm and dry, the perfect kind of weather that I love to have. As we take a look at the current temperatures across our region, 75 degrees in Marion and Bluffton. Still warm off towards the north, 72 degrees in Angola and Defiance for us. For Fort Wayne, we reached our high today at 73 degrees, about 15 degrees warmer than normal this time of year for us. So it won't last long as we take a look at our storm track radar. Still mostly sunny skies, but we look off towards our west into Valparaiso. You start to see some showers and zooming out across the Midwest. You start to see a strong line of showers and storms in central parts of Illinois, just east of Springfield. That's heading towards our way. It's a cold front that's going to move through tonight. Once that cold front passes through, expect to see cooler temperatures as our winds will come out from the northwest. It will be windy tomorrow. And expect to see some maybe stray showers still lingering areas off towards the north like Angola and LaGrange. But then a high starts to drift in, and that's going to bring us drier weather for Saturday. But then if you look a little bit off towards our west, another storm system looks to bring some rain for Easter. So let's take a look about what's this storm system moving in. As we get around about 9 o'clock tonight, you start to see a weak line of showers and storms but if you look down towards our south like Blackford and Jay County and even Grant County they will see some strong storms move through areas north of the Summit City we might see some rumbles of thunder but the stronger storms to be towards our south we'll still see some scattered showers early Thursday morning and then drying out Thursday afternoon with partly cloudy skies. So as we get through tonight, areas down towards our south of our region are under a marginal risk, which is a level one for severe threat. That's area shaded green. If we, as we move down further south in Indianapolis, our shaded orange, that indicates a level three for enhanced severe weather. But for us, the severe wet is low, but a couple things to keep an eye on. Damaging winds, hail, and even heavy rainfall we could see. Not only that, once that cold front passes through, it's going to be a windy Thursday. We're going to see sustained winds up to 25 miles an hour and winds potentially gusting up to 30 miles an hour. So it's going to be very breezy and lingering into Friday morning as well. So once that cold front moves through, temperatures drop back down to the 40s for Thursday and Friday. We'll get around normal by Sunday for Easter, and then we drop back down the 40s by Tuesday. Look at the rain chances, mainly dry for the next three days, but then for Easter and Easter Monday, there's a chance for some scattered showers for us as we get through tonight. Showers and thunderstorms, overnight lows dropping back down to the low 40s. It will become windy late past midnight as we get through tomorrow. Expect to see partly cloudy skies. You might see a few little stray showers lingering areas off towards the north, just like Angola for us. But as you take a look at the forecast, we won't see temperatures in the 70s for the week ahead. We might get around seasonal, not too bad of an Easter, some scattered showers, but much cooler temperatures ahead. Krista?